Witchers are known as warriors with unusual powers, the slayers of monsters and fiends, and eliminators of other forms of devilry. One day, the elite Witcher Geralt took on another contract, his task to subdue a sorceress. The now aged woman, though ever strange, had been greatly respected, yet in recent years, Rumors had spread that she was dabbling in the dark arts. She had achieved prominence as a researcher of planes, but if she were to call forth a demon from another dimension, it could have grave consequences. Accordingly, she was a threat to be assessed and, if found guilty of iniquity, a threat to be contained. In search of the truth and prepared to mete out punishment as necessary, Geralt made his way to the ruins of a citadel standing amidst marshlands. So, that's why I'm here. To check if these suspicions, accusations even, are true. See these demons you've summoned, and if you have, to stop you, punish you. That's the contract. Tell me, Witcher, do you know what I've studied all these years? The magic, the... Planes, passages between them. Heard you're an expert. Pretty tricky for someone working on their own, gotta admit. And you? Do you also label me a heretic? No. Don't get me wrong. Got no reason to suspect you of anything. Yet. Just wanna talk. My greatest wish was to access a different plane. Right. Got that much, I think. But that is not to say I ever wish to commune with, let alone summon demons and spirits from other worlds. Through rifts into other dimensions, I explored the possibilities, sought another plane. I was but a fisherman casting a line. And then it happened. What happened? A response. A strong one from something powerful in a place altogether elsewhere. Bold you are, Witcher, even to venture here. If you wish to see if my studies deal with demons, why, have yourself a gander! <sighs> Heads pounding. Where the hell am I? Some sort of passageway between planes? What's at its end? Another dimension? Whatever it is, sure doesn't sound pleasant. Huh? Don't try me. Beast that. Good to know my silver sword works, though. Medallion won't be much use. Got too much to say, huh? to be from a foreign land. Something strange about you. Let me guess. Sorcerer? Some may call me that. However, I have mastered the use of weapons. <sighs> Place seems full of people just looking for trouble. Burn! 
Interesting. Now I see what power you hold. It appears my plans will have to change a bit. To think it would be possible to travel between worlds. Fascinating. Someone sent me here. I'll be sure to tell her how you feel. Long as I actually make it back to my own world, that is. Forgive my discourtesy. Pleasant journey, stranger. Every which way you turn here, you get a skilled warrior. Including that last one. Could get in some good practice. No. Got things to tend to. Pressing matters. Strange as all hell, this place. They seem to believe in magic, but refuse to practice it. Should have enlisted that guy's help. Might have been a real sorcerer. Preparing potions will be a pain. Huh? Could you again get teleported here against your will? Believe me, I know the feeling. This way, and I'm still killing monsters. No rest for a witcher. Won't do me any good, though, hunting beasts out here. Just not supposed to be here, plain and simple. Gotta get back to my own world. Seem to be places of power in this world, too. Marshes, mountain-bound vales. Source of the power could actually be in another plane. Speculation of that sort's best left to mages, though. Gates appear where in but whenever I get too close... <laughs> that happened. Sorry, not of this world. Don't know your customs. So have a taste of my own. Battle 
One. Gate spawns more of those creatures, then shuts again. Need to keep it open somehow. Should probably well. What is it you must got a favor to ask of you? Is that a friend of yours? Hmm? <laughs> no. <sighs> Freaks around here really seem to love me. <laughs> Yada, yeah, show you. That's how I ended up here. Listen, there a gate around here that connects to other worlds? As you know, the gate to astral chaos sometimes opens unexpectedly. But to open a gate to another realm, you would need to utilize the power of the sword locked deep within astral chaos. Go on. Simply opening the gate will not be enough. You need a signpost that definitively points the way. It needs to have a strong connection to where you came from. Phantasmal Care Morin. Gotta be it. If you open the gate at the right place and at the right time... All sounds good. Except, well, I'm a stranger here. Sure you're allowed to reveal such secrets to me? Hmm. 
I believe I can trust you. One learns a thing or two after years of brutal training to sharpen one's skills to their- Thanks for the help, old man. You should know. It is a perilous way. There is no room for error, and you may even fail through no fault of your own. I know not whether I should encourage such a gamble. Worth a try, far as I'm concerned. Very well. I shall teach you a secret ritual for eliciting the power of the spirit sword, Soul Calibur. We finally meet, Geralt. Like a dog after a bone. Not interested in fighting you. You cannot escape me. Fine. Your funeral, then. Don't say I didn't warn you. It's about to open. Party ends now. What? But I was just getting into it! Had a worthy opponent in you. No two ways about it. Love to finish our fight. But, well, Witcher duties call. So, you are returning home? Very well. Come back anytime. I'll be waiting. 
So long, Samurai. It's been... emotional. Been one hell of a ride. Great. Now just need to get through the damn gate. Let's do this. Um... Sri Vasu Svaha. Uh, am I back? Witcher! As I live and breathe, you have returned. Uh, head feels like it's gonna explode. Mind keeping it down? Forgive me. My methods were a bit harsh. However, at least now you know I am innocent. No? Well... It'd take some time. Then step over here and make yourself comfortable. Would you care for some fine wine? Mm, warm welcome. Nice and all. But as I see it, you owe me a lot more than that. The names of the warriors whose fates were bound to the two swords have been etched into the very fibers of history.